Hello and welcome to a masterclass on how to connect a database to um, VB6, in particular an Access 2007 database. You've got to create or find an Access 2007 database. I've got one called videoshop.accdb, which is video shop, uh, videos and uh, clients but you can create anything you like or you can download these files uh, at www.darksprite.co.uk slash db1.zip and you need to get hold of VB6 Service Pack 6 you need to get hold of the Access Database Engine.exe you can also do a Google search for Access Space Database Space Engine and that will um, give you the Microsoft site for the Office 2007 redistributable uh, data files which is this file basically and you download that. So you install the Service Pack 6, you install the Access Database Engine, this is a crucial step uh, and then you do new text document and test1.udl uh, just a blank thing which you then click and uh, change the provider and you have the massively powerful Microsoft Office 12 Access Database Engine Only DB provider. Do next. Data source you need to stick in is the name of the database, in this case videoshop.accdb. Default settings for admin. Do OK. Um, and that's the data link file setup which is to this videoshop.accdb default for access 2007 settings you could have saved it as an MDB file but everyone forgets that and saves it as a default settings in office 2007 which is for access.accdb right so then we start up Microsoft Visual Basic start a standard executable save that file save project put it in the right place One. One. Uh, we haven't got the proper component here so we need to go to project components control T uh, and find Microsoft ADO data control do OK which is msadodc.ocx in the system32 do OK we get an extra little thing here drag that create it ADO DC right click properties, use data link file, browse, find the thing, uh, test1.udl, apply, and OK, and that creates the, uh, the connection, now we do the properties again, record source, we want to change that to table, and if it doesn't error on us then we know we've got access and in there is various things one is assets let's stick that in and OK and then create a label and in the label um, properties data source ADO DC uh, data field let's call it item close that that gives that one let's connect that to there and then let's do another one if we can properties use data link file and record source table and this time contacts and do apply and OK and I'll do another label and connect it properties data source DC2 data field um, let's give it first name close that save that all and play and so we've got a video and this is the customer I haven't got any more customers but we have got lots of videos And there you go, the beginnings of a work of genius.